everyone. So I am starting this vlog a little bit late because um, my vlog camera was dead and it also had like no memory so I had to go fix that. But um, if you watch my snap story, basically I'm in San Diego, San Diego, I'm in San Diego right now for the Star Trek premiere which is really cool. My ratchet suitcase, he's got it. What is going on? Okay. There's Comic Con right there. Um, I think it's tomorrow, it's starting tomorrow. But anyway, wow, I am so scatterbrained. Um, yeah, we flew here today. Yeah, so there was like a guy in a suit and he was holding up my name and I was like, that's my name, that's so weird. But it was really cool. And the seats in the car were so comfy. Um, <laughs> this looks really cool. I'm gonna show you what I'm looking at right now. This vlog is crazy, but um, I can't tell if that's a real Ferris wheel or not. Um, there's the freeway. And then over there is the marina. And last time I was here for spring break, and it was a great time, and I, uh, yeah, anyway. <laughs> um, I, I feel like I need to tell them about the whole situation, so I'm just going to say really quickly. Okay, last time I was in San Diego, I was with Adam, and we were dating, and we're not right now, and a lot of people don't know that, but some people do. I made a Periscope talking about that. And I've been getting so many questions, so I felt like I needed to tell you guys. Uh, yeah, we just kind of broke it off because, I don't know, it just wasn't like the same anymore. I'm not going to give you like a whole explanation, but yes, we're broken up. And I'm fine, so we're both fine. Like, whatever. <laughs> it's sad that we broke up, but we're not going to like wallow in our sadness, so yeah. Okay, I put my sunglasses on and I'm keeping them on because I look very homely, but <laughs> <laughs> um, we got the tickets to the world premiere. Yeah, and it's an outdoor movie, which is really cool. Um, hey, like my outfit is just so horrible because we're only here. I thought we were only here for like one day of like enjoying San Diego, but we're here for two days. And so look what I'm wearing. Like this is all I have. I have these like gray jeggings pretty much. And then <laughs> this, which I just wore <laughs> to the airport. And I didn't think that I, I would show this cause I thought it was gonna be cold. So I put this on and I just really am having a hard time right now. And I'm really hot too right now. I'm sweating. Here I am in my cute little outfit. <laughs> Now we're finding a nail place. Oh yeah, done. we're going to the mall to get my nails done because nowhere does acrylics apparently and I want acrylics because I haven't had them in a while. Also, they're like setting everything up for Comic-Con and it's really something else. Like, I cannot believe how big of a deal Comic-Con is. Like, it's a huge deal. It's a big thing. It's really cool. So, wow, I'm hot. I really am. It's really hot here. And uh, <gasps> I love him. That's Liam from 90210. That Ghirardelli is so cute. And then there's Urban Outfitters. Oops, I think I was covering the mic. But the gas lamp district is so cute. I love it. Wow. Hey, okay, getting my nails done. We are at a pizza place and I just got my nails done. They're shorter than I thought, than I anticipated, but like, they're good. And I paid for like this special shape where it goes like narrow, but it's not even narrow, so that's cool. But it's okay. I wanted a nude, and I thought this was gonna be like a brownish, but it's gray. They look good, like I like them, but it's just not what I had in mind, so yeah. But I like them, so it's okay. I haven't had acrylics in like a month, and I like them. We got some pizza. What is yours? Feta, spinach, <laughs> and tomato. Nice. And yep, I got pepperoni, obviously. Look at my nails, everyone. <laughs> okay, so 
Went to Urban Outfitters and got actually three things, which I wasn't anticipating. I'll probably show them to you later on because I really like everything I got, but I was not anticipating getting anything, but I did. Mm -hmm. and, right. and I saw two viewers there, so shout out to you guys. I didn't catch your names, but it was really cool. They're from Arizona, right? Yep, they're from Arizona, so I got a, yeah, so I got a Clueless shirt and a Tupac sweatshirt and a really cool choker. So I'm very excited about that. And, and I skinned my ankle and it bled lot, a lot, lots and lots. Yeah, she doesn't even know how, but it, her ankle's bleeding. And yeah, it is lit at the, the gas, gas lamp. La what is it? Gas lamp. At the gas lamp district. No. Uh, quarters. District? Quarters? Quarters. It's really cute at night and there's like so many people. And there's the little, oh, you can get that little go-mobile thing. What's a go-mobile? The little bicycler. Oh, the bicyclist. They like blast music and their things light up. I'll show you. It's Comic-Con weekend, so there's like 3,000 people. It's not even a weekend, what am I saying? It's Tuesday, yeah, especially because so it's Comic-Con week. It's like crazy, so. Yeah. Oh, there's one. There's one. Gotta catch them all. So he's playing music, but you can't really tell. Here's another one. The sign is so pretty. Hi guys. Sorry I've been so bad at vlogging, but today all we did was lay out. My mom is straightening my hair, by the way, <laughs> because we're about to go to the red carpet. But anyway, today we worked out, and then we laid out at the pool for an hour without sunscreen, so I'm really freaking red. I think oh, it was longer than an hour. That's my bra strap. It was a long time, but as you can see, I'm extremely red, and my tan lines are insane. Well, my sunburn lines. Are. Okay, we're ready. Okay, so anyway, yeah, I just got ready, and I filmed it all, so that will be on my main channel. You can click the link in the description box to watch it, but uh, yeah, we're going. Um, we are going to the Star Trek premiere. Hey! Hello! <laughs> Drink okay. your water, drink your water. Okay, okay. Um, here's my outfit. I've got some hoop earrings, a choker, some chop, top shop, Target, I think. Oh, hey, Mom. Um, this is from Brandy. And then this overall dress thing is from Boohoo.com. And these boots are from H&M. So there's the outfit. And I'm just going to have my hair straight, like, behind my ears because I don't have time to do anything else. And I'm pretty happy with my makeup, so it is time to go. We're a little, little late, I guess you could say. We have to walk there, so hopefully I don't like sweat off my makeup or anything. Paramount Pictures is arriving, and this is a huge bus. That's so sad. Oh my god, Guys, it's Simon Pegg. Bye. See you later, Simon. There's John Cho. Oh, Chris Pine. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. No, no, no. Oh, he's going where I should be going. Isn't he? I'm so red. Look how red Chris Pine just walked by. He might be coming back, but I have to wait to get on the red carpet because like I have to meet someone and my sunburn is like really showing through right now Just don't mind me being a tomato. It's okay. It's fine What? This is so cool. We got in to the um, showing of the movie, but I have a story to tell you guys later. I like couldn't walk the red carpet, but I, I'll tell you why later on. But yeah, um, we got a free like ticket to get a, like a Subway snack pack thing. I'm so excited. And I'm so sunburned. Got my food. But not my Getty images, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> All right, got our dinner. Yum. And the sky is really pretty. Love it. This is really cool. It's a whole outdoor movie, but it's still IMAX. So it's really cool. Oh yeah, we got these bracelets. Show them. Mine won't turn oh. on. It's supposed to turn on during the show. Wait, show mine. 
Can I turn on later? I hope so. Oh, you're supposed to click it? Oh, yours doesn't work. Go tell them that yours doesn't work. Oh, mine works. Okay. Go tell them. Okay, thank you. You're gonna want it for later. Yeah, do you want a picture up here? Here's here's the thing. I'll show you that later. Yeah. Is it fun to play that? I would think it's always fun to play the villain. No. No. No, uh, it was fun to play it because it was well written and it was a very complex story. Uh, the makeup was a challenge. Uh, yeah, that's all I'm going to say. Mine too. Uh... The movie's still going on, but um, we just took some pictures and uh, recorded a little bit of my outfits. So, um, we're just taking a break from watching it now. We're gonna go watch it again. Yeah, but this is a really, really cool event. Like this is amazing, and all the actors are here, as you saw, and um, the music is all live. Like the orchestra is playing the entire movie, which is so cool. Yeah, there were fireworks and a light show at the beginning, which was awesome. And this is just really fun. So, other than my hair getting messed up by the humidity, it's good. It's good. Hey guys, okay, so the premiere just ended, and I got this really cool hat. And this is the bracelet that you got when you went in. And then we got four of the um, movies. We got four Star Trek movies. And we got a shirt, and then we got these like seat things. And this bag filled with everything I just said. And what else is in the bag? I don't think anything else. But yeah, so I'm a Star Trek fan now. Yeah, thank you, Coca Cola and Regal, for sending me out here. And you got to see Chris Pine. Yeah, I got to see Chris Pine. He was like three yards away from me. And John, John Cho. Cho. <laughs> the little boy from Modern Family. Like the youngest in the Dumpy, Dumpy? Uh -huh. In the Dumpy family. I made eye contact with him. It's pretty cool. He walked by me and I was like, hey. <laughs> oh, Conan O'Brien. Conan! <gasps> Christian Slater. I still don't know. <gasps> I am positive it was him. Okay, Christian Slater. I grew up watching him. <laughs> and um, I think that's it. Chris Pine is really cute. Oh, when I saw Spock, what's his name? I don't really know his name. Spock is cute to me. Yeah, he's cute. He's cute. We got free Subway too. So. Yeah, we got free Subway. It came with a really sandwich, homely. chips, co cookie, and water. It was really cool. So I am. Everyone's looking at me. What's good? <laughs> My camera's dying, so I'm just gonna tell this story pretty quickly. But um, basically, we get, we go to the red carpet area, and the security guards are like. Hey, hey, you know, you have to wait here. And I was like, oh, I was supposed to go on the red carpet. And he's like, wait here. And I was like, okay. So I'm not telling this quickly. I'm really telling it in depth. <laughs> anyway, um, so then we wait and then we went. They finally let us go. And then um, I tried to get into the red carpet because there were like, there was an opening to get into the red carpet. So I was like trying to walk in and they're like, wait, who are you? What are you doing? And I was like, oh, I, I came here with Coca-Cola. I'm supposed to like walk the red carpet, that's what I was supposed to do. And they were like, um, you need an escort or you need whatever, I don't know. They wouldn't let me in, so I was like, okay. So then we stepped aside and there was this lady there and she's like, wait, what's going on? And I was like, well, I'm a YouTuber, I was sent here, I was supposed to go on the red carpet, blah, blah, blah. And she was like, oh, um, oh, and I was also, I was supposed to meet up with the Coca-Cola people, but I hadn't heard like anything, so, we didn't know where to go and I was like we don't know where to go and we don't know where the people are and blah 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 and she was like oh well I could get this Paramount Pictures lady to escort you in I don't know so she texted her and the lady said that she was running late and she'd be there in 15 minutes so we waited and we kept waiting and waiting and waiting and like 30 minutes had gone by and we were just watching all the celebrities get out of, get out of their car which was really cool so I mean it wasn't that bad but we were waiting and waiting and we're like what the heck and the lady that we had talked to that said the other lady was coming had left so we didn't really know what to do so we just kept waiting there and then we saw her and we're like oh there she is 
let's ask her what's going on. So we asked her and she was like, oh yeah, the Paramount Pictures lady said she looked for you guys, but she couldn't find you, so she thought you left. And we were like, uh, okay, what? So she just gave up on looking for us, which is so weird, and she was in the red carpet area. So she's like, oh, I'll just go get her from the red carpet area. So she goes in, doesn't come out for another 10 to 15 minutes, so we're like, okay, we're just, we're just gonna go to the movie. We start walking, and there's a fence going all around the red carpet area. So we look into the fence, to look at the red carpet and the crowd control people are like, oh, you have to keep moving, come on, we have to keep moving. And there's like no no one else but us. Like there's no crowd that she's trying to move. Anyway, so I was like, oh my gosh, cause I was so fed up with it. So I kind of gave her a little bit of attitude and I was like, oh. And she's like, you don't have to act like that. And I was like, okay, well I was supposed to go on the red carpet but it kind of got like messed up and everything. And then she was like, oh, I'm so sorry. And I was like, Mm -mm, I don't like you and then right at that moment the Paramount Pictures woman came out and she was like Hey, um, are you Summer McKean? And I was like, yes! Oh my gosh! And um, she was like, basically she said, yeah, you can't go on the red carpet and I was like Cool, all right, perfect. So then we just went into the movie area. Yeah, we thought everything was fine and then we um, We go get our free subway, which was pretty nice and then we saw another red carpet area and it there were there was no one on it and it was open and it was lit and everything and um it looked like just a place that you could take pictures so we asked a security type lady if we could go on it and she was like yeah that's supposed to be used for pictures as far as i know you can go on it and so i'm like oh cool so i start to walk on it and i'm like snapchatting and stuff i didn't post it on my story or anything but i was snapchatting it anyway as i was saying i was on the red carpet i was like Snapchatting and everything and this man comes running at me and he was like, no, 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 you can't be on here You can't be on here and I was like, oh, sorry The lady the security lady told me that I could be on here and he was like, which one who was it? Was it you and he like pointed at one and he's like security is gonna get you and then I was like <laughs> Bye, so I like walked off the carpet and he was like, yeah, no, oh my gosh who who even anyway so then i walked off the red carpet and he was like this is no this is closed and there was just one row but it wasn't even like blocking it off like i got on it didn't even look like it was closed or anything so he like moves it so that it looked like it was closed and he's like yeah this is closed this is closed and no one used it the entire time like no one used it so yeah then we got into our seats and we were fine with our subway and we also got these seat covers, where are they? Oh, they're over there, but I showed you them. We got like the seat cover things and there was some popcorn there too, so it's kind of cool. And then, um, yeah, you saw the rest. Um, that's it for this vlog today. It wasn't a whole lot. I kind of started it in the middle of the day, but I didn't do anything interesting before it. So, yeah, um, my sunburn is really kicking in. I mean, it's been pretty bad the whole day, but um, <laughs> it's really obvious right now. Um, I'm just gonna get ready for bed and go to bed because I'm very tired. It's like 1130 and Yeah, tomorrow we go home tomorrow. Our flight leaves at 430, which is yes I'm excited to be home. I love it here. Like don't get me wrong. I love it here But um, I haven't been able to be home for more than three days in, for like a month So not a month for like three weeks. It's not a good time but yeah, I'm going home. I'm going to be in Oregon for a week and then I'm going off to Utah on either the 31st or the 1st of August. So yeah, but then in August, we're good and I'm going to be home for a while. But yeah, anyway, ah, that's my little schedule. Rundown of the schedule. Um, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, don't forget to drop me a like. And if you have never seen my vlogs before and you watched this to the end, you should probably subscribe. If you want to. I don't know. Do you want to? Do it if you want to. Okay. I'll see you guys in my next vlog. And I love you so much. Bye.